And finally, just like a standard trucker's hitch, all you gotta do, pull it back on itself, and it's a quick release. Welcome to Corporal's Corner. Today I want to give you a quick tip or trick to keep your ridge line tight when you're using a trucker's hitch. So stick around. One thing I've noticed over the years is that certain people, especially youth, have a hard time pinching that loop with the trucker's hitch to your ridge line before you tie it off. And it's my opinion that unless you have a firm grip on that loop to your line, what tends to happen is the ridge line wants to slip and it builds up slack, causing it to bow, meaning that your shelter won't be as tight as it could be. So today I want to show you something that we're playing around with at the Pathfinder School to keep your line not only tight, but allow you to make it even tighter. So let's get started. Let's grab one end of our cordage and we're going to tie a simple bowline. Just going to rotate it over like this. Take our end, go up through, go around, back down inside, and pull it tight. Now taking my bowline, all I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap around this tree. Taking my other end, I'm going to pass it through the bowline. That forms a pocket. A pocket right there. So now grabbing a tent stake or even a stick for a toggle, I'll place it inside that pocket and I'll pull it tight. And we've created an improvised Marlin spike hitch that can be used as a quick release. Pull it out, we're good to go. So just like a regular trucker's hitch, on this end I'm going to go around that tree and grab my line anywhere along here. I'm going to rotate it over. I'm going to lay it down, I'm going to pull it through towards that tree, and that gives me my loop right there. I'm taking my other end, I'm going to pass it through that loop, and from here for a standard trucker's hitch, all I would do is pull it, and the tighter I pull it, the tighter it's going to be, and like I mentioned before, trying to pinch that loop to that line. Sometimes it tends to want to slip on you, and the more it slips, the more slack you're going to have in your ridge line. So all we're going to do from here is we've already wrapped through here one time. We're going to wrap inside this loop once again. If I were to pull this towards my tree, it's going to tighten it up. So all I'm going to do from here is take it, go around from the back, and place it back through that loop and pull all my excess cordage through that loop. As long as that second wrap is underneath the first one, I can now pull this, and what tends to happen is it will bite down on itself right here, keeping your ridge line tight, and then you can pull it again and make it even tighter. Now to test it, I can let go, and it stays tight it again and make it tighter and now I can finish it off right here the same as I would for a standard trucker's hitch. Just pinch your loop, drape the excess over, reach inside, and pull it through. And finally, just like a standard trucker's hitch, all you got to do, pull it back on itself, and it's a quick release. Welcome back. This is good to go. Now, like I mentioned before, it's just a simple tip or trick to keep your ridge line tight and make it even that much tighter. I ask you to give it a shot, try it out, let me know what you think, leave some comments below. Thank you for your comments and view support. Thanks for watching. Get out in the field, have some fun. I'm going to catch you next time.